What's going on guys, CryptoHoy here, and in this video, I'm just going to do a quick review on Dugetti. I previously covered this on a recent video, which you guys can go check it out. And I showed here, you know, that um, on this Glassdoor review for uh, for this company, Lannistar, it mentions these tokens, it mentions Big Ice Coin and Dogetti. So this is a former employee for this company, and allegedly, it seems like they are connected. Uh, Big Ice and Dogetti are both owned by the same company or owner or ceo could we expect the same thing to happen the same outcome to happen on the giddy what happened on big guys because we all know that big guys just ended up being a huge huge uh, rug pool perhaps i i think uh actually beating uh squid games uh squid games i think they were only able to uh rug pull somewhere between like 9 million or 19 million or actually less than 19 million i think it was somewhere around 9 or 10 million if i'm not wrong uh you guys can correct me in the comment section down below but it wasn't as much as this one which was like 50 million dollars and they claimed that excluding all the bonuses it was only 27 million dollars but the point is that that is way more than squid games whatever that amount whichever the, of those two amounts is it is still more much more than squid games but anyways and so there could be a connection between Dogetti and Big Eyes. And again, like I mentioned here in this Glassdoor review for this company that alleges that uh, that they have been uh, working on these tokens. But anyways, uh, when we go here into the actual uh, website for Dogetti, we see here that they're really trying to convince you to buy this token. They're even showing live hits, meaning they're showing here live purchases. All right. And again, I don't even consider this as an investment anymore. This is more of a gamble or even like a lottery to see if you're lucky to see if perhaps this token, you know, goes up in value and price as, you know, like Shiba Inu did or Doge or some other tokens. Uh, the, it doesn't really happen as much, but to see if you're lucky and perhaps can 10x or even 100x or more but they're really trying to convince you here to buy this and this could you know be a very high uh high price high ticket price uh lottery ticket if if you will but um when we look at over here uh and when i look into the white paper to be honest there isn't much utility like most of these meme coins don't offer much utility because it's not about the project it's all about that hype it's all about that pump and dump because that's what most people actually care about um, they don't really care about the project or what they offer is just for that initial pump and dump and it, to see if they're lucky to make any money 10x or whatever amount and just after that just withdraw and then just move on to the next pre-sale so right here is no difference it doesn't offer any utility it says that 75 percent of the tokens are going to be sold on the pre-sale or available for pre-sale and there's a total of 100 billion tokens the total supply which is half of what big guys because big guys was 200 billion if i'm not wrong and then this one right here uh dogetti is only 100 billion tokens total supply and 10 percent is going to the exchanges um i think that's very little i think the pre-sale amount should be less and they should have a little bit more for the exchanges because it needs to be able to have enough uh liquidity for the purchases and everything and to be honest um you know sometimes they add a little bit on the exchange because they think that people are going to be buying the tokens therefore the value is going to go up but in reality we see that that's not really what happens uh when we go here to uh let me go here real quick to poloniex we see that even right now for big guys even after the launch the price doesn't really go up it is way below uh what it, what it's supposed to be um uh, for the pre-sale launch price all right it's supposed to be at, for big guys it's supposed to be triple zero six and right now is at quadruple zero one all right not nothing close to what the launch price uh was expected to be or not even like it's actually below or around yeah it's actually below sorry a uh, stage one price because even at stage one is a triple zero one and right now is a quadruple zero one so it's like like almost 99 or like 95 percent uh down than uh what it's supposed to be but anyways so being uh, you know listing this at an exchange is not really going to increase the value of it and if you're only putting a little bit people are just not going to buy people that's why people buy in the pre-sale most of the time um yeah so that's one thing to also keep into account here if you're planning on investing on this token and right here on the roadmap there isn't much uh as well uh they're just trying to get more access here family members 
uh, 5,000 family members and then over 250,000 family members, which means people that are holding this token. And then uh, phase one, which says here, welcome people to the first first uh, 1,000 Telegram members. And what you guys also got to watch out for here on their chat uh, or on their Telegram, especially there's it seems like there's no moderators because I went out when I went in there to check, there were just people posting a lot of uh, sensual uh, gifs or gifs. Um, you know, a lot of stuff like that, like even close, close, like borderline adult content there. And um, nobody seems to report them. I didn't see anybody like saying anything or trying to remove them or ban people because they're doing something of that nature. They just they just let them do whatever they want. It looks like Telegram is like do whatever you want in there. And at least I personally have not seen anything like that. Uh, just keep that in mind. And also right now they're giving a, a special offer, quote unquote, which is 500% extra. OK, which, again, is very similar to what Big guys was doing as well towards the end of their pre-sale, which is stage 15. They were offering a stage one price, which was like around roughly 500% of already 500% uh, already up. All right, like 6x pretty much. And yeah, that was that was just crazy of that bonus. And Dogetti is pretty much no difference here. They're offering 500% uh, upfront right now. And when we go here to their Twitter, uh, right here it says 500% bonus. And they even and it even does the math for you. Okay, it says right now a hundred dollar buys you six hundred dollars worth of Dogetti or Dogetti. So they're pretty much trying to like really, really push this hard. OK, very similar. OK, the same similar tactic to big guys. And um, and if they are under the same owner, they may want to try to do this because, hey, if they were successful with big guys and they might have the same success, OK, quote unquote, with Dogetti, they're just going to keep doing this because people are still buying their token. This is just a, another thing to keep in mind. And imagine that you're giving one hundred dollars and you're getting six hundred dollars back the other question is where's this money coming from because it's not coming from their pocket okay they're not gonna give money just for free that has to come out of somewhere and if a lot of people are doing this then where's that money coming from 99 percent of the times this money is coming from the same pre-sale that means from other people's money but if they all are doing the same thing, how can they afford this? And that's what you guys need to understand. Um, in this case, it sounds too good to be true is because it is too good to be true. And they do this. Why? Because they know that a lot of people using this tactic, a lot of people are going to buy into this. And then when the launch uh, comes, okay, when it comes to claim your tokens and to actually go to the exchanges, we may see something very similar to what just happened to big guys, where there's not enough liquidity. The price is way below than the launch price. What but they were uh, saying that it was going to be what they stated. And then people are just losing their money. Why? Because there's not enough. The value is not being backed up by the amount of liquidity. And at the end, they don't need to like give any explanation or anything. They'll just make up an excuse, blame it on the market, blaming that we are uh, on the bear market or even blaming a bot like big guys was doing and then just move on and then just create a new token and repeat the whole process again. So we just got to really, really watch out here, guys, for this. And um, as always, you know, it, when if you decide to go into this, just remember to invest whatever you're willing to lose and always do your own research. And um, at this point, uh, Dogetti is looking more as as like a lottery, as a, as a gambling thing than an actual investment. So there you go, guys. Uh, share your thoughts. What do you guys think about this in the comment section down below? And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.